This is Carolina. She's a four-year-old red-sided eclectus. She and her beer partners, the Greenberg. Uh, they are one of the few species that are dimorphic, they call it. So, it used to be a long time, but for a long time they thought that uh, there were two different species, the males being green and the females being uh, red and blue and kind of purple. Oh, well, red here and purple down there. And there are different kinds. This is a, she's a red-sided eclectus, like I said. There are different kinds, like Soleil was a, a Solomon Island, and a Cherie is a Bosbury. There's a Grand Eclectus. Um, ouch, and there's a bird that's biting my neck at all. Her beak was messed up, and we had to uh, get it straightened out a little bit at the vet. Somebody had attacked her right around there, and anyway. But there was no reason why, um, you know, girls or women shouldn't learn how to play harmonica. <coughs> oh, sorry about that. Grab your tool. Um, you know, there's a prejudice sort of maybe slightly against it. It seems like in, in blues, there's a... When you see women blues players, I mean, they're... They have a right to play that stuff. Just like guys. Bonnie Ray, you know, rock and blues and folk kind of thing. She's a great leader. And, of course, all the incredible blues people in the past, past that were women, of course. But for harmonica, I'm talking about, you know, you don't see that many women harmonica players. And especially, especially parrots, women parrots or girl parrots that play uh, harmonica. So I'm going to try to teach this little thing something, but she got to hear me play a little bit to get the idea. She has heard me play a little bit, but let's try a little bit more. Now that's, uh, I was playing cross position. That would be considered second position, um, harmonica to the guitar. So this is a uh, C harmonica. I would be playing in the key of G. If there was a guitar player, I was playing in the key of G. Um, but anyway, the thing is, is that to start, if you've never played a harmonica, you just want to put it in your mouth. Understand this, Carolina? Yes, like, like that. Put it in your beak or your mouth, whichever you should have. And you go, like from the middle note, that would be the four. Well, you just want to put it in your mouth and just get used to it. Go. Let's draw. This is blow. That's right. Yeah, that's right, Carolina. You just blow on it like... Now draw. And I've just got my lips um, pursed to it, pressed to it. Now, if you can start out by putting your tongue on the harmonica, immediately you can save yourself headaches. Because tongue blocking is... Uh, my tongue was on the harmonica. Can you do that, Carolina? Yeah, yeah, you got your, your tongue is right, right, try it out. Yeah, you got the right position. Can I try it? Okay. Good, Carolina. That's good. Perfect, Carolina. Now you're getting the right idea. That's without my tongue. Now, let's see. Carolina, put your tongue on it. That's good, Carolina. Let's try the lower note. That's great, Carolina. Good for you. That's great. Good for you. Good for you, Carolina. We call that success. Now, she is a, what do you call it, a, a genius. She had never done it before. She's a genius. Great work, Carolina.
Thanks for watching. Have a good evening or morning or day.